Uh, Wait a uh, second. Uh, comments on this motion. I'd like to wish the, the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya, Kenya regarding the Shagwa, quick, quick recovery. recovery. He is still the President of the Republic of Kenya as of 9 p.m. on the 17th of October until uh, uh, any decision is made. So the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya, we pray that God gives him the strength and God gives him the strength to continue uh, uh, pursuing that uh, responsibility. Mr. Speaker, the Council of County, County Assembly began, began his opening open statement and the National Assembly. A train right in our room. Where did the train come from? In this video, me and Mikey got an important task. We have to deliver gold to our village. Thomas the tank engine will help us. What? The troll found us. He wants to steal the gold and break our train. Who will save us? We were sleeping in our beds, but suddenly... Oops! I fell out of bed. What was that? Huh? That was a train whistle. Yeah, it's like a train right in our room. Where did the train come from? Let's go to the balcony and see what happened. Look, it's Thomas. Wow, it's down there. Let's go take a closer look. Yep. Maybe Thomas will let us ride in the locomotive. Wait for me. Mikey, where are you? JJ, look at me. What are you still doing there? I decided to do a little parkour. No. Are you okay? I survived. Let's find out together what Thomas is doing here. Maybe it got lost? What? Is the mayor here too? What is he saying? He's asking for help. Sure, mayor. What do you need to do? We need to get the gold. Who seduced her? Who connived with her? And who paid her? for the act of adultery. Mr. Speaker, in this Republic of Kenya, we must drain the swamp of adultery. And today, just like back in the days when the law of Moses required that a woman who had been convicted or accused of adultery ought to be stoned to death, unfortunately, Mr. Speaker, it looks like the same punishment was not prescribed for men. It, it was just for women to be stoned to death, and yet it takes a man for a woman to commit adultery. Tonight, because the Constitution of the Republic of Kenya is just like the law of Moses, it says if you are found guilty of political adultery, you should be stoned to political death. It is called impeachment. You are sent into political purgatory for 10 years. You cannot run for office. Mr. Speaker, we must deal with the law as is. The law as is requires us that the woman or the man accused of adultery must be stoned to death in this chamber. That is the law as it is. But Mr. Speaker, we must make sure that we bring those other men and women who commit and who encourage people to go into adultery so that they also face the same sentence and they also face the same judgment. Mr. Speaker, I am convinced that political adultery has been committed in the case before us. There has been a conversation about a dubious shareholding structure of the Republic of Kenya. If the Republic of Kenya was a corporation, as we have been told, or if it was a political party, then we would have 56 million equal shareholders from Moyale to Vanga, from Nyateke to Nyandiwa, from Mumala to Malaba, Mr. Mr. Speaker, it, it cannot be restricted to a geographical uh, entity called, called a mountain. Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, I am convinced that political adultery has been committed in the intimidation and threats to judicial officers. I am convinced that political adultery has been committed in public attacks on our intelligence service. Mr. Speaker, where I come from, if you find your father naked, you don't proclaim his nakedness, you cover him. And we, and we cannot then proclaim the nakedness of our intelligence service. Mr. Mr. Speaker, I am convinced that the Deputy Speaker has committed political Deputy adultery. Deputy President. Sorry, sorry the, the Deputy President, president <laughs> has committed, has committed uh, 
Uh, I, I'm, I, sorry, I'm sorry, Deputy Speaker. Speaker. As, as committed political, political adultery. Speaker. I'm sorry, Speaker. For, 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 your time is up. Uh, <laughs> your time is up, Senator Murango.